The following presentation is rated WPC. More stock footage. Gotta love yep. it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for finding uh, this. Glenda and Brian. Need to think us real. We're all just now this was sent to me days, pretty much fully written, uh, and I just edited it and uh, now, just a helped finish off the ending sure for him, but <laughs> I think it I came off. Yeah. Okay. I, I, I don't know if we shot know this in a point. dance studio late at night, remember? <laughs> I know, they're like, what? I was always like, well, we can't really <laughs> want to see these posters. We're going to be like these cops. Or we had to move a lot of stuff. <laughs> really into ballet. <laughs> but it worked. We shot at, what, three different locations this day. Yeah. And then we had to come back and reshoot some of this. Yeah, for this one, because they closed. We, we just ran out of time. Yeah. We just ran out of time. But it worked. We tried to do it all in one day, but, I mean, it just was too much. Yeah. And then... And this was at the studio. And I remember the, how meticulous we were with that lineup, trying mm -hmm. to get it as straight as possible. I know. We have Gary and Gev, who playing the criminals. They were fantastic. Welcome to low-budget shooting, y'all. Yeah. You know the drill. Your number's up. <laughs> forward, and we'll keep the line. The guy did a good job, though. Gary's facial yeah. expressions make. And then that's the introduction of anxiety. <laughs> Just somehow ended up there. He gives me a Jack Nicholson vibe. I really, I really enjoyed working with Brian. Yeah, uh, I think I told him, give me a little Clint Eastwood, Clint Eastwood and Jack Nicholson. Yep. Ass clown. Hi, my name is Anxiety the Crown, and I will be auditioning for the role of third criminal. He thinks this is an audition. <laughs> Brian is perfect here. <laughs> yeah. Was that too little? Was that too little? <laughs> oh, Gary. Oh, Gary. He was great. And Jeff's like, really? <laughs> and the horn out of nowhere, the left. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy blew his ears out. Yeah. This is, we actually came back and had like an hour to shoot this. Yep. We scrambled that. We did. Assholes. Again, assholes. <laughs> this was the scene. The close-ups were shot in a completely different location. Yeah. We had a green screen studio. Yeah. It's fun though, it's fun to take a script with limitations of like, this is the time, this is the money, <laughs> can we actually make it work? work and yeah, can we sell and it? It's seamless and people don't know that it didn't Number take two. exactly what it did to make blood, sweat, and tears. That's right, it really was. <laughs> and Allie, uh, one of the producers, did the makeup for, for uh, this one. Anxiety, yeah. She did pretty much designed his face, didn't yeah, she? Yeah, she did. Another J Jill of all trades amongst mm -hmm. our friends. Anxiety's just building Gary's character up. Whatever. He's so happy. He's so cute. Gary. <laughs> Had him an Oscar. You're forgetting Another he's Oscar a criminal. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of my favorite parts of the whole sketch. You win. <laughs> I love that he hit the glass. Uh -huh. It was great. Great take. <laughs> <laughs> the great thing is, is 
yeah. the actors aren't on that side of these shots, so they did such a good job without having the exactly. criminals in front of them. Hands in the air and nobody gets hurt. <laughs> and scene. Stop saying and scene. Stop saying and scene. No, don't repeat that. You fucking ass <laughs> clown. <laughs> That's it. It was a good, He's the one. good exchange. Very funny. You it. This guy, I don't know if it was the, the makeup, the shoes. <laughs> <laughs> the eyes. Great. Oh, he is. I didn't even notice. Glenda's just oblivious. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking. Hi <laughs> guys. The clown outfit is completely optional. I just choose to wear it in my line of work to distract the children. Sick son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Kidnapping and auto theft. <laughs> <laughs> I love his response. It was very good. It was a good what? This ending was something we worked on for a while, trying to figure out how to tie this up nicely and not, I mean, it's such an outlandish sketch. <laughs> you don't know how to tie this up, but I mean, yeah. you just have this woman who's a dramatic, you know, a theater teacher. Keep the clown outfit. Huzzah! <laughs> Screw Cody. Nobody cares about He's Cody. He's fine. <laughs> you think they go out later? Jeez, yeah, remember? look at how flirty she got. <laughs> Where are you going? Tell my captain this case is still ongoing. <laughs> Do you still validate? Watch out for the ballerinas. Oh. Loved this. <laughs> Again, all improvised. <laughs> I'm with a nose askew a little bit. <laughs> That's my Aww. favorite part. <laughs> One of my many favorite parts. There you go. There you Get out go. of the box. The end. Uh, the that end. Was fun. That was Let me take you back to the future. I was home alone with nothing to do, so I hopped in the car, headed to the mall. If I a box of chocolates, I'm eating them all. There she was, working the counter. Don't know what it is, but there's something about her. I got to approach, but I don't have the balls. Come on, but man, you're killing me smalls. Okay, okay, I can approach her. I know I can, I'm a brave little toaster. But what's my line? I need one for real, though. No, you don't, just keep it short like Willow. No pressure, just don't be lame. Ask her favorite book or video game. You're right, keep it light, that's a good call. So I asked her if she likes movies or football. Let's go, the rhythm we flow. So they pop the popcorn and lock the doors. Let's go, from back to rose. Yeah, you know where we at. Let's start the show. Let's go, the rhythm we flow. So they pop the popcorn and lock the doors. Let's go, from back to rose. Yeah, you know where we at. Let's start the show.